Good morning, everyone. My name is Mike. This week on Cognitive Clicks, we will be talking about completion bias, phone addiction, and form filling. So, what is completion bias? Completion bias is a cognitive bias, one of many, uh, researched originally by Drs. Daniel Kahneman and Alex Tversky, who received a Nobel Prize in Economics on their work on human decision-making in 2002. Completion bias is quite easy to understand from a personal perspective. It's that little feeling of satisfaction that we get when we're looking at a task list and know that we can check something off it. So every time you check something off your task list, you are actually receiving a dopamine hit. You're receiving a little uh, hit of the pleasure chemical and you feel good about yourself. Why does this happen? Because from an evolutionary perspective, it's a very good idea for our brain to encourage us to complete tasks. If you think about it and you're sitting in your cave where it's nice and warm and now you have to go out and you have to go hunt mammoths and you have to go and collect berries and mushrooms and whatnot, it's a good idea for your brain to encourage you to do that by giving you little hits of the pleasure chemical. The issue is that um, our brain has evolved very slowly while our culture and society have evolved much faster. And we still get these dopamine hits even when we finish much easier tasks than hunting mammoths. So for example, uh, the applications of completion bias are pretty uh, extensive and we see them all the time online. Every time you fill a form or complete a profile online, you are actually leveraging completion bias. So the more you fill in, the more you uh, complete the form, you're feeling good about giving these details. The reason you're feeling good is because you are being fed more and more dopamine as you finish more and more sections of the form. The same applies to phones. Um, Phone addiction is a, a process wherein completion bias and dopamine hits are run in a loop, and here's how it works. So we understand that when we see a notification and we swipe it away, our brain understands this as completion of a task and gives us a dopamine hit. The problem with dopamine is that, like any chemical, our brain slowly and gradually develops a, a, a tolerance for it. And so we need more and more dopamine to reach the same level of satisfaction. And our phones are very happy to do that for us. We get more apps, we get more notifications, we swipe them away, we get more dopamine, and we find ourselves inside a loop. So how do we break the chain? How can we become less addicted to our phones? Very easy. All you have to do is turn off all the notifications on your phone, and then you break the cycle. There are no more red dots, there are no more notifications to swipe away. You are now no longer in a position where you can get dopamine from your phone, and gradually your phone addiction will subside. So that was a very brief video on completion bias, form filling, and phone addiction. If you enjoyed this video, please comment and share, and I will see you again next week on Cognitive Clicks. Thank you very much for your attention.